There have been many powerful warriors throughout the millennia. But ages of mortal combat have begun to tear at the fabric of the realms. The critical point has finally been reached. It was foreseen that combatants would one day grow too powerful and too numerous. If left unchecked, their intensifying combat would weaken and shatter the realms and bring about the Apocalypse. <laughs> <laughs> gods demanded a safeguard be put in place to avoid total destruction. One that would make use of the combatant's insatiable bloodlust. Like moths to flame, they would be drawn to battle. It is done. Taven and Dagon have been hidden. The dragons, Orin and Kara, will be at their sides. I trust they will be safe in the caves. I only hope Shao Kahn shows no interest in Earthrealm. It is unlikely. His attention seems focused only on Adenia. The pyramid is completed. 
You are certain the battle will take place here, Delia? I am. I have sent Blaze to monitor the realms. When the time has come, he will signal the dragons and the quest will begin. Are we doing the right thing, Argus? Your visions determine this course of action. The powerful warriors to come. The corruption of a mortal combat tournament. The chain of events you foretell will lead to a conflict that will destroy us all. These combatants must be dealt with. I am talking about Taven and Dagon. Must they be involved? Our sons are the only ones we can trust. Furthermore, they will prove their worth before the Elder Gods. They will bring honor to Adenia. And to you, if they survive. We have equipped them well, and the Monoliths will hone their skills. This must be done. Dagon and Taven will remain dormant. When they are revived, they will embark on a quest to save the realms from Armageddon. May the Elder Gods watch over them. Taven, it is good to see you have awakened. Do not worry, your strength will soon return. Orin? What happened? You were encased in stone to protect you from harm until I received the signal to awaken you. You are no longer in Adenia, Taven. You are in Earthrealm. I don't understand. Why am I in Earthrealm? Your father has a very important task here for you. Your brother, Dagon, will also be participating. It is a competition between the two of you, from what I understand. What? Competition? Last I remember, Dagon and I were summoned to Father's throne room and... And there you were both rendered unconscious. I don't know the details of this quest. I was charged only with hiding you in Earthrealm and awakening you when the time came. That time is now. No. This is all too strange. Where is my father? I wish to speak with him. I will send you to his temple. Find the main chamber and place your hand on the altar. Your father will speak to you there and present you with a weapon to use on your quest. No doubt your brother has been awakened by Carl and will be sent there shortly. Why will I need a weapon? Very well, Oren. Lead the way. Who are you? I'm Cobra. No one crosses this bridge. No one. We shall see. Cobra, I just got the signal from Cabal. The ambush has begun. If you're not a member of the Black Dragon Clan, I'm gonna have to finish you. Taven, place your hand on the monolith. Father? Where am I? This is a training area. Father, is that you? No, Taven. I am merely a reflection of your father. My purpose is to train you for your coming challenge. Would you tell me what this is all about? You will find your answers within the temple. This monolith was created to help you hone your fighting skills. There are others like it scattered throughout the realms. They can only be activated by you or your brother. Now then, let us begin your training. Was I inside the monolith? How was that possible? Maybe Father will explain when I find him in the temple. But there is always room in the Black Dragon Clan for another ruthless warrior. I have no intention of joining you and your thugs. You will regret your decision. Fight! Strange looking warrior. At least I won't have to deal with his clan any longer. Looks like I've finally arrived at my father's temple. I didn't know he had one here in Earthrealm. 
I'm sure he'll explain everything once I locate him in the main chamber. What are these images supposed to represent? That looks like Mother having one of her visions. And this must be Father speaking with the Elder Gods. These sleeping figures might be my brother and I. How long was I unconscious? And what's this? It appears as if my brother and I are attacking some demon. I have no memory of that. What does all this mean? Where is everyone? It doesn't seem like anyone's worshipped here in ages. to prove your worth to Adenia. I must choose my successor as protector of the realm. I give you each a weapon of great power. You will find them on the wall behind this altar. Your mother has also left you items of great importance. You will find them in her temple to the north. What are they? What is their purpose? You must find Blaze, a fire spot created by your mother. Use the items we have given you to defeat him. The victor will not only succeed me as protector of Adenia, but he will receive a gift worthy of a god. Go now, and may the Elder Gods watch over you. Sector to Warship, rendezvous for immediate evac. Grandmaster Sector. The prisoner is awake. Good. Now I can get the information I need. Ugh. Oh, what are you? I will ask the questions. I need to know what you learned from the altar in the temple. What message did you receive? Answer me! You are going to regret having torn... Increase power! So <laughs> what information did you acquire from the altar? Uh. Master Sector, the ship is being attacked! Incoming fighters! Special forces! Takunin Warship, this is Sonya Blade. You are in violation of the Earth Realm Accord. Surrender immediately or risk annihilation. Remain at your post. Initiate code K0NN1H5. Affirmative. I must get up this warship before it's destroyed. I have to find some way out of this ship and back to the portal. You are not leaving me till I get all the information I need, even if I have to beat it out of you. Fight! Finally, I found a way out of the warship. I'll have to get back to the portal and return to the cave. Maybe Orin has some idea who these strange warriors are. I can't help but wonder if my brother Dagon has encountered the same foes I have. Welcome back, Tate. You were awake quite a long time. I was ambushed. More than once. By your father's holy men? No. His followers apparently abandoned the temple long ago. Warriors in red occupy it now. This is not right. Something is amiss. Did you learn more about the quest? Where is the weapon your father left you? There was no weapon. I'm assuming it was stolen long ago. As for the quest, apparently it's a race to combat a fire spawn named Blaze. Whoever defeats him will succeed father as protector of Adenia. Yes, Blaze. He is the watcher who sounded the call to awaken you. But how can defeating him in battle grant you the title of protector? Your mother was mortal. You are only a half-god. Transforming you into a full god would require... Require what? What else did you learn? 
I must travel to the north. Mother has left me an item in her temple. I hope it's still there. I will send you there now. Blade of the Earth Realm Special Forces. You've got some explaining to do. What are the Takunin up to? Why do you assume I have information? You have some connection with Sector. He placed a homing device on you that I've been tracking since you teleported away from the Takunin warship. First to the heart of the mountain, then to this frozen wilderness. I can follow you anywhere. Now answer me! What is Sector planning? I appreciate your assistance with the beast, but I am afraid I cannot help you. I know nothing about Sector. You're hiding something. Comply or I'll be forced to bring you in for further questioning. I'm the son of Argus. You have no authority over me. I have full authority. You must have been sent by the gods. Yes, in a manner of speaking. You must help us. Our abbot has been captured by the Tengu. You must free him. I am not here to rescue anyone. I am looking for a temple. Do you know of one? A herald of the gods who searches for a temple. Only the abbot would know of such a place. He could reveal to you its location. But if he is slain by the Tengu, you may never find it. You must save him. Very well then. Where can I find this abbot? He is being held in the Tengu encampment. That way, to the north. Thank you. I appreciate your help. Now excuse me. I am grateful that the gods would send a hero to free me. I did not come here merely to free you. I need information. I was told you knew the location of a temple. You must be referring to the temple of Delia. Return me to my fellow monks and I will reveal its location to you. By the elder gods. Very well. Lead the way, old man. We are here at last, our place of worship, the Holy Obelisk. Once again, I am humbled that the gods would deliver me from peril. Yes, the gods are great. Now, if you will please, direct me to the temple. Indeed, the Temple of Delia, the Lady of Flame. Built to honor the Adenian sorceress who foresaw the great battle, legends tell that... The... Please, I am in a hurry. Yeah. The temple is down this path. I thank you for your help. I wish you good fortune. Ah, I see the obelisk begins to glow with the power of my fellow monk's prayers. I only pray the Tengu did not defile it with their touch. Taven, you have entered an obelisk of your father's creation. I have empowered it to train you further in the art of combat. You're not really my mother, are you? No, I am not your mother. I am merely a reflection of the woman who enchanted this stone. My purpose is to aid you on your quest. Can you tell me more about this quest? Only that you will find a gift in the temple. It lies behind a wall. Place your hand in the recess to unlock the door. Your training will now begin.
Stop where you are. Your dark allies may have escaped for now, but you have nowhere to hide. Kill him! Kill him! I cannot be harmed. Well done. Wait, stop! You are free to go. Oh, I'm free to go? After I've already defeated your entire clan? How generous of you. <sighs> my sincerest apologies, warrior. When I was told that you had attacked my men near the obelisk, I assumed you were with the other two outsiders we encountered. But clearly you're human. You must be Lin Kuei. I haven't the slightest idea what you're referring to. And what is a Lin Kuei? The Lin Kuei are a rival clan of powerful warriors. You fight with such skill, I mistook you for one of their ranks. We Tengu have an uneasy truce with the Lin Kuei, and we avoid their territory. They reside in an ancient temple near here. And where would this temple be? Further up this path, it is not far. But you would be wise not to venture near it. The Lin Kuei are secretive, and as inhospitable to strangers as we are. I will be ready. Thank you for the information. You are free to go. What? So it is true. Delia's son has returned to claim the prize and save the realms. I figured you would eventually come to this place, Taven. You seem to know much about me, but I know nothing of you, friend. I am no friend of yours. I am Rain, a prince of Edenia. Once I have defeated you, I will find and kill your brother as well. Then I will claim the prize. Well, Prince, let us see what you can do. The Tengu leader was right. My mother's temple is here, but it's now occupied by a clan of ninjas known as the Lin Kuei. Locating the item she left me will not be easy. I'll have to fight my way inside. in ice. Who are you? I am Frost. Where? Sub-Zero? Uh, Sub-Zero? The medallion! Give me the medallion! You seem to be a bit delirious. Maybe you should... The Lin Kuei will be mine! Uh, at last, an empty room. Maybe I can rest? Think again, intruder. You may have bested my Lin Kuei warriors, but you will not get past me. Uh, and you are? I am Sub-Zero, Grand Master of the Lin Kuei. And you are trespassing! Fight! Your tattoo? What about it? It resembles the dragon image on the door behind you. Who are you? And why are you here? This must be it. This must be what? This temple was a shrine to my mother, before your clan commandeered it. I assure you, it had been abandoned long before we arrived. I realize that. My name is Taven. I merely came here to retrieve something. A gift from my mother. Then tell me, where is this gift? Most likely behind this vault door. The door on the right was unlocked when we first arrived here years ago. There was nothing inside. The other door has remained sealed, despite our best efforts to open it. It seems my brother has already been here to retrieve his gift. Strange. I would 
would mean he's been awake for quite some time. I assume you have a key. You could say that. You have your gift. Now tell me, for what purpose would a sorceress leave her son such a powerful set of armor? Apparently, I need it for my quest. Something important is supposed to happen once I complete it, though I do not know what that something is yet. At first, I assumed the quest was nothing more than a game, but I'm no longer certain. What do you mean? A warrior named Rain mentioned something about saving the realms, and I've also been repeatedly attacked by assassins in red. I don't recognize their crest, though it seems vaguely familiar. A dragon, I believe. Do you have any idea who they are? I may. Grandmaster! More intruders have breached the temple! The east entrance! Friends of yours? They are dark warriors, yet they resemble our own Lin Kuei! Yeah! <laughs> Time to choose sides, friend or foe. Uh, I'll help. Then defend the Lin Kuei Temple. Smash these new intruders! shall see. I should thank you. You probably saved my life. Who is he? He doesn't seem human. He is Noob Saibot, a warrior from the Nether Realm. He is my brother. Your brother? Why did he try to kill you? He was corrupted long ago, but now I have the chance to save him. The Lin Kuei owe you much, Taven. In return for your aid, I will help you find the men who have been hunting you. They are called the Red Dragon, a clan of mysterious warriors. I can't help you get inside their base, but I can reveal its location. Where? Shard Mountain. It's unfortunate that Sub-Zero's brother has chosen a path of darkness. I wish I could help him remove the corruption that fills Noob Saibot's soul. But now that I know the location of the Red Dragon stronghold, I must return to Orin. He will be able to transport me there. Maybe then I will find some answers as to why I am being pursued. Taken, you require a suit of armor? It's the item Mother left me to help with the quest. Are you ready to begin your search for blades? Not yet. The warriors in red ambushed me again outside the temple. I met someone there named Sub-Zero. He gave me information that could lead me to them. Who are they? He said they're called the Red Dragon Clan. His Lin Kuei recently located their stronghold. It's in Charred Mountain, 
I would like to visit them before I search for the Firespawn. They may be the ones who stole my father's sword. Will you send me there? As you wish. Stop, Taven. Fujin! I sense that there is more significance to your actions here than is apparent. I suggest you return to Edenia immediately. I would like some information first. The Red Dragon have attacked me twice. I'd like to know the reason, and I'm not leaving until I find it. Such ignorance. I will stop you, by force if necessary. I respect you, Fujin. You are a friend to my family. But I will not leave. Then you leave me no choice. Fight! I didn't want to do that. Fujin has been an ally for many ages. But I need to confront the Red Dragon. This must be the entrance to their stronghold. I hope they haven't been alerted to my presence. I'll soon find out. Taven. Dagon! You look... older. I am older. Much older than you, big brother. So you were awakened long ago. Why are you here? This is my stronghold. Your stronghold? And these warriors? I formed the Red Dragon Clan many ages ago. There must be some misunderstanding. Your soldiers have been hunting me. There is no misunderstanding. For years, my clan has infiltrated every corner of Earthrealm searching for you. Scouting parties were placed in locations where you were likely to appear. At our parents' temples, for instance. I see you found your armor. I wear mine always. Why would you send your clan after me? Isn't it obvious? I intend to kill you. What? The prize will be mine, Taven. I will not risk losing it to you. Grandmaster, please excuse the intrusion. Speak, Mavado. Blaze has been found. Excellent. I must make preparations. See that my brother never leaves this stronghold alive. I need to find my brother, Dagon. He must still be in these caves somewhere. Who are you? Kaino's a name. I am Taven. Do you know what the Red Dragon are doing here? Seems they're trying to create real Red Dragons. They've been able to create a hybrid of man and lizard, using their own clan members as test subjects. And you were next? They were trying something new on me, but they'll never finish. <laughs> Wait, I have more questions for you. Chi, I have done as you commanded. Then give me what you have found. I, I, I couldn't risk detection. I didn't carry the records with me. They're all up here. What? <sighs> Kill him! Close the portal, dragon. I command you. Karo! Get away from him, lizard! I am reptile, and I do not answer to you. Fight!
Kakaro, you're injured! I have been enslaved here by Dagon. He uses me to teleport his clan anywhere in the realms. I can't believe he could be capable of something like this. He is not the man he once knew. What happened? I am partially to blame. Long ago, I lost mental contact with the Firespawn Blaze. I mistakenly took it as the signal to awaken your brother, but it was too soon. Reviving him early had unforeseen effects. Dagon was unbalanced. He was outraged that he had been manipulated by your parents and demanded to know the true purpose of the quest. Did they tell him? Perhaps. Whatever he learned must have disturbed him greatly. He killed them both. Killed them? Impossible. Father was a god. Mother was a powerful sorceress. How he did it is of little importance. They are gone. And I am to blame. Do not condemn yourself. <sighs> Nevertheless, I wish to atone for my mistake. Moments ago, I created this portal to the Nether Realm for your brother. He is there now. You must follow him. Leave now. I cannot hold the portal open much longer. I will return to help you. There is no need. I intend to stay here and destroy this atrocity Dagon has created in my name. When I am done, the Red Dragon will be nothing more than broken bodies strewn throughout the hollows of this mountain. Go now, and may the Elder Gods watch over you. I am torn by Karo's request to leave him in the Red Dragon stronghold. He and Orin have long been friends to my family. Together they have protected Edenia from many perils, not the least of which was Shao Kahn's unsuccessful invasion years ago. But even in his weakened condition, Karo will not be easily defeated. I imagine he is combating the Red Dragon Clan already. May the Elder Gods watch over him. Dagon must be at the base of this mountain by now. I'll have to make my way down. Shinnok? Why is an Elder God here in the Nether Realm? It seems as though he needs help. How the mighty have fallen! This day is ours! Die, Shinnok! Tavon! Where did you come from? I am weakened, son of Argus! You must protect me! Step away from Lord Shinnok! Now! You will pay for your interference! Your assistance could not have come at a better time. You defended me against the she-devil Li Mei, and for that, I am forever grateful. I don't understand. Why did you need my help, Lord Shinnok? You are an Elder God. I am an Elder God no longer. I have been cast down, punished for involving myself in the affairs of mortals. Now I am cursed to preside over this wretched nether realm. What could you have done to anger the Elder Gods? Hm. Boldly asked as always, Taven. Perhaps even a former Elder God may be permitted to ask his question first. Why are you here? I'm looking for my brother, Dagon. Yes, I remember him. You competed with one another often. You won most of the games, as I recall. But what makes you think he's here? I followed him here. He's been corrupted somehow. I don't know what evil led him to this place, but when I find him, he'll have much to answer for. I will help you find him, Taven. But first, I will need to regain my throne. Demons and strange warriors have overrun my sanctuary. Help me clear out the invaders and you will gain my favor. But you must listen to my instructions closely. What must I do, Lord Shinnok?
The idea that Shinnok, an Elder God, resides within the realms is beyond belief. That he requires my aid is even more baffling. But I will assist him any way I can. It seems that demons and other beings have cast him out of his own spire. I will defeat them all, floor by floor if need be. Demons have overrun my spire. Looking for trouble, I hope. Careful, Taven. This one is most unpredictable. You know him? I am Havoc, a cleric of chaos. Shinnok will not regain control of anything, so long as I draw breath. Havoc is down, but there will be more like him in the chambers above. Who are these invaders? Why did they attack you? There is no time to discuss that now. We must make our way to the next chamber before more arrive. Quickly, enter the portal. We have reached the top chamber at last. My throne will restore my strength. Your throne? Shiva! A Shogun? Here? The Spire is ours! You fight for Shinnok! You will die for Shinnok! Another one? Destroy Kintaro so that I may reclaim the Spire! My thanks to you, Taven. You have restored to me what little semblance of authority I have left. I am honored to be of service to an Elder God. Former Elder God. But I do appreciate your loyalty and respect. You may rise. Your brother. Yes, he has been to the Nether Realm, but he is not here any longer. I sense that he has gone. Back to Earthrealm. What? Earthrealm? I will send you to him. But you must leave now. Thank you, Lord Shinnok. He is strong. Quite strong. And a skilled warrior. I told you he was a problem. He passed all my tests, destroyed my apparitions with ease. More quickly than you did. Perhaps I am aiding the wrong brother. What? You swore you would help me. Fool. <laughs> Your brother has been effectively delayed. His means of teleportation has been eliminated. Forgive me, Lord Shinnok. I didn't realize. It's just that your aid is vital to my success. Our success? There is more to this quest than you know. All things have led to this moment. The prize is not merely some gift, as your mother and father would have had you believe. It will determine the fate of many immortals. A fact I will use to my advantage. I don't understand. I have informed other warriors of the prize to hasten their participation. They will think, as you did, that godlike power will be bestowed upon the victor. It is a deception. They are marching to their doom. You shall be the victor, and the catalyst of my ascension. What must I do, Lord Shinnok? Strange. Shinnok knew that Dagon had been to the Nether Realm, but he didn't mention it until I cleared his spire of invaders. Now he has sent me back to Earth Realm. None of this makes sense. I wonder if Orin knows anything about Shinnok's fall from grace. Orin, are you all right? Dave. I am mortally wounded. Did Dagon do this? The sorcerer. 
Quan Chi. He somehow discovered the location of this cave. I... I think I've seen him before. I believe Quan Chi wants to prevent you from leaving Earthrealm. I've kept the portal open, but I'm growing weaker. You must go through now, or you will be trapped here. I promise you, Orin, I will find this Quan Chi and make him pay with his life. Go now, and may the Elder Gods watch over you. Shao Kahn's fortress. I must be in Outworld. I suspect Quan Chi is already inside. I must find a way to get in. This looks like Shao Kahn's dungeon. No sign of Quan Chi here. Quan Chi hasn't been down here in ages. I am Melina. Hmm. Not bad. Care to dance? Stranger, the key you found, it will unlock my cell door. Please free me. How do I know you won't attack me? You have only my word. I am not here to do battle with you. My task is to eliminate Shao Kahn. <laughs> Alone? This I must see. I thank you, stranger. I am Shuchinko. I am Taven. You plan to defeat Shao Kahn? Whole realms have tried to overthrow him. Not only will I defeat him, but a host of his allies. They are in his chamber now, plotting some coming battle. I allowed myself to be captured. From this dungeon, I can enter Shao Kahn's soul chamber. Once there, I will be able to destroy Shao Kahn and all his allies in one stroke. I suggest you leave quickly, Taven, for I cannot guarantee your safety. My safety? I just defeated this entire... Ah, foolish old man. I could release their power, but I can't reach them. Enjoying the view. Who are you? What are you doing here? At ease, Shokan. I am looking for Quan Chi. Have you seen him? He is with the Emperor. I am Goro. I have been ordered to let no one pass under penalty of death. My death? Or yours? <laughs> Those were elite guards, if you say so. I assume you are here to kill the Emperor. If anyone deserves to die, it's Shao Kahn. But I'm here for someone else. Quan Chi. Ah yes, he is in the next room with the others. As much as I would like to see him die, I have been charged to protect the Emperor's allies. I am Reiko, general to Shao Kahn's army. The Emperor could use warriors such as yourself. Mm, as a rule, I don't ally myself with egotistical madmen. Hmm. Then I'm afraid I will have to kill you. And that is why we must put our differences aside and join forces. 
Why should we believe you, Quan Chi? Why should we trust you? I will not join an alliance of traitors! Shang Tsung, Shao Kai, Onaga, my comrades. We are all treacherous by nature, and betrayal is to be expected. But if we do not stand together, at least initially, it could mean the end of darkness. I stand with no one. I will claim the prize and with it destroy you all. Onaga. Emperor Onaga. Not anymore. <laughs> you haven't been listening to what Quan Chi has told us. The forces of light also seek to acquire this power. You cannot defeat them alone. Only if we join forces does one of us have a chance of winning the prize. But which one of us? If Onaga is the victor, he could use that power to overthrow you. I'll take that chance. Hmm. What of the brothers? What can be done about them? I have trapped one of them in Earthrealm. The other is in Edenia. We must go there now. Our allies are waiting. To war! Do not go through that portal. Raiden, you look different. But I'm glad you're here. I need your help. Shao Kahn and his allies are planning something. It is none of my concern. I don't understand. You always fought against Shao Kahn's forces. Now he's planning another battle and you won't lift a finger? We must not stand idly by. We must stop this- No, Taven. I have struck a deal with the Emperor. Shao Kahn will honor Earthrealm's independence when his forces have won. When he's won? What are you saying? Why would that lunatic spare Earthrealm? Because in return, I will prevent you from completing your quest. I cannot believe that Raiden would side with the enemy. Since this quest began, nothing has made sense. My entire life has been turned upside down. I want to abandon the quest, but if I do, Dagon will win, and he has become far too corrupt to replace Father as Protector. At this moment, the forces of darkness are invading Edenia. There must be something I can do to stop them. At last, home in Edenia. They appear to be somewhere near the ancient craters of the Southlands. My brother, Shao Kahn, and his allies, they are all here somewhere. And they will all die here. Who are you? I am Scorpion. I seek revenge. Revenge against me? Against the Elder Gods. They betrayed me. As reward for doing their bidding, they promised to resurrect my clan. They are no longer dead. They are the undead. For this treachery, I will eliminate the Elder Gods' only means of saving the realms from Armageddon. I will destroy both your brother and you. Well done, Taven. Dagon. I was hoping Scorpion would kill you and spare me the effort, but it looks as though I will have to finish you myself. Blaze! Why did you interfere? The quest has been corrupted. All did not go exactly as my creator had foreseen it. You are in the wrong location. I will transport you to the rim of the crater where the final battle will take place. The quest will conclude when one of you defeats me there in combat. We must make haste. Many warriors are gathering. If I am defeated by one of them, 
they will steal the prize and the true purpose of the quest will have failed. Armageddon will be upon you all. I want nothing to do with this quest. My business is with Dagon. No choice. We are all bound to the quest. The fate of the realms will be decided today. Then let's get this over with. I have waited an eternity for this moment. When this is over, I am going to finish you. How did we... Dagon? Ah! <laughs> you used to be faster than me. Last time we raced through Father's Temple, I believe you won. Seems like only yesterday. It was yesterday. I suppose it was. For you. But I was awakened prematurely. Over the millennia, I've grown much faster, much stronger. This time, my victory is assured. The only thing that is assured is that you will pay for killing mother and father. So you know. Yes, I killed them. I had to. Lord Shinnok warned me that they had decided to assist you. You killed them over the prize? With the very weapons Father gave us to use against Blaze. And now I will use them to destroy you. Fight! Unfortunate. It was not intended that the brothers combat each other. Dagon has fallen. Now you must fulfill your obligation. Obligation? The quest destroyed my family. Explain to me why I should care. Your mother, my creator, foresaw the coming Armageddon. That through mortal combat, warriors would unknowingly tap into the very forces that make reality possible. Those warriors are in the crater below, engaged in mortal combat. All of them? But with that many fighting in one place... This crater will be the origin of the Apocalypse unless something is done to prevent it. The Elder Gods had ordered your father to orchestrate a solution. He decided to kill them all when the time came. But your mother argued to merely strip the combatants of their special abilities. For some were heroes, undeserving of death. In the end, they conceived of a contest between you and your brother. The victor would unleash one of two solutions. Like a coin toss, one side would disarm the warriors. The other would destroy them all. Which side of the coin am I? It is unknown even to me. Your armor is the catalyst. The fate of the combatants will be revealed when our battle is done. So by defeating you, I could be killing them all. They are unimportant. Whichever outcome, you will be saving the realms. But you must not let anyone else combat me. Then allow me to win and we'll put an end to this. No, Taven. I must act according to my creator's design. Take your sword, walk through the archway and finish the quest. My world.
world has been ripped to pieces. I awoke in a foreign realm, forced to complete a quest set forth by my parents, Argus and Delia. This quest, though intended to save the realms, has destroyed my family. My brother Dagon became obsessed with winning the ultimate prize of full godhood and murdered our parents. And in his madness, he sought to destroy me as well. Orin and Karo, dragons loyal to our family for ages, were not spared from the curse this quest has wrought. Dagon enslaved Karo to serve his own ends. The sorcerer Quan Chi killed Orin, who was my guardian. Though I had nothing left, I was determined to complete the quest. I faced many combatants, fighting my way to the top of the pyramid until at last I alone defeated Blaze in mortal combat. The energy released by his death passed through me, granting me full godhood. The excess power then filtered through my armor and passed into the other combatants. Though this energy was to have one of two effects on them, death or annulment of their powers, a third, unforeseen outcome resulted. The quest did nothing to resolve the instability of the realms. But as protector of Adenia, I vow to stave off Armageddon until a solution can be found.